case briefs and so much more ls data's got what you're looking for in 1998 the new york supreme court appellate division heard the case of trustco bank national assin v eakin which highlighted the responsibilities of mortgages and mortgagors in securing foreclosed property. The case stemmed from a foreclosure action on a property that had been vandalized while vacant. The defendants had purchased two adjacent apartment buildings in Rensselaer County for $188,000 in 1993, executed a mortgage on the premises for $157,000 in 1995, and defaulted on the mortgage in February 1996. A court-appointed receiver was assigned to protect the property. However, the defendants drained water pipes and did not provide additional funds to secure the property. The lower court ruled that since the mortgagee, Trustco Bank, failed to secure the property, they were responsible for the vandalism and denied their request for a deficiency judgment. The mortgagee appealed the decision, and the appellate court ultimately held that the plaintiff was entitled to a deficiency judgment for $43,664.15, payable by the defendants. The court found that the mortgagee was not required to preserve the property, but noted that it would have been prudent to seek court permission to secure it. The defendants, as mortgagors, had the legal right and incentive to secure the property, but refused to do so. The appointed receiver was not held personally responsible for the property's financial state. Additionally, the court reversed the lower court's imposition of costs on the plaintiff without explanation or hearing, stating that the plaintiff's conduct was not frivolous. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class